Hey guys, Crystal and Shadow here, back with Pokemon Emerald, and we're going to get, get a, a phone, phone call. call from Haley, who won a battle. I was gonna go to the wind streets, but then I remembered Tim might not be healed, but they are in fact healed. Yep. Okay, let's go here, see what he's got. He wants us to battle his whole family. Four in a row. Four people in a row. Yep. Which isn't that spectacular, because I think all in all, that still only roughly adds up to six Pokemon, so... Yeah. Plus, we're trying out some new team members today. Mm. But Spark would have been better. Yeah. But, yeah, for some reason, the father of the family is the weakest one. Well, yeah, you battle in the same order you do in the anime. Yeah. That's right, they even let Max battle. That was a fun episode. I liked that episode as a kid. Yeah. Except here, the daughter is like the second best. Why would they make Max, someone who's not even a trainer, battle the second best one? Well, here she's using like a last sprite, not like a really young kid sprite. Yeah, yeah, also, how come in the anime she looks too young. Like, she looks Max's age. What even is Max's age? Why do we meet so many kids who look as young as Max, but have Pokemon? Well, she only has Pokemon at her house. It's not like she's on a journey. True. Yeah. True. You can have a po There's no rule against having a Pokemon. You just can't go off on a journey. It's like alcohol. You can battle at your own home with parent supervision. Sure, that's how it works. <laughs> that's not how it works. Then how does it work? It doesn't work. It doesn't? No. Yeah. I, mean, I don't know about other countries, but yeah, kids can have some alcohol at their home with their parents. Depends on their age and it depends on the circumstance. Yeah. Are we going to beat this or is it going to keep healing itself? Oof. I guess we're going to switch out. That works too. Do we have any flying types? Yes. We've got I don't know if it knows a flying. Yeah, yeah, it does. All right then, there you go. We got Wingo, and you turn remember we caught last episode or one of the previous episodes. Did you go to the PC between episodes? Because I swear this wasn't in our party. No, because last we caught them in one of the last couple of episodes, and I figured, yeah, I'll give him a boost. Oh right, you would have um yeah between episodes you went to the PC and you um did some training. Yeah, only for these two. I caught these two up to the rest. Yeah. The re I haven't, I didn't touch any of the other team members. I just let these two catch up. Yeah, that's fine. That's right. What's this girl? I can't remember. I think she has a metatype. Mm -hmm. No, See I think the grandmother has a metatype. In the, in the anime... It, she has a camera. Yeah. In the anime, it would make sense for adults to be better trainers. But here in this game, I think they're trying to be, like, symbolize it with um, gaming. So, like, the kid is one of the best and the parents are not as good. You could have stuck with Electric and used Spark. I was scared of getting hurt. Oh, well. Whatever. Mega Dream. Yeah. Come on. Really? We couldn't one shot him now? Nope. Well, I guess okay. I guess I guess we are more of a physical attacker. Maybe. Because grass is all special attacks. Yeah. Grass, water, electric, psychic, dark, um Ice. Ice. Fire. That's it. Dragon. Yeah, and dragon. We'll just do this. Oh, sure, we can one shot you. We <laughs> can't one shot somebody with a type advantage. <laughs> Hello, baby. Sorry, I made you kill your baby. It's not his baby. <laughs> they could be related. She could have caught it in the same place. Sure. Well, to be fair, it's the only place in the game you can get Shroomish, I think. Yeah, so they're all one big colony. Sure. They're all related. Yeah. That doesn't make sense. Sure they are. But if I go catch another Shroomish and stick it in the daycare... Then incest, yeah, that's how it works. No. 
Whatever, I told you she had a meta tie. Yeah. Because in the anime she had a camera up. <laughs> Imagine if she did have a camera up here, that'd be so mean. Oh, for God's sake. <sighs> waste our time, Dan, waste our time. Ah, almost. Yeah. <sighs> You're not achieving anything by using detect. It's not like we're poisoned. Yeah. If we were poisoned, it would be a legit strategy. Or if you knew we were going to use high jump kick. Yeah. Whatever, we beat the wind straights. I think now we can just head to the gym, talk to Wally and all that stuff. Yeah. Um, they have a present for us. I don't remember what. It's a macho brace. Uh, it it okay. makes your EVs go up twice as fast, but it slows you down. I love EVs. <laughs> no, not that EV. There's no EVs in Emerald. Oh, that's not fair. But you can't get... But the thing is, there's no EVs in Emerald. You get EV in Fire Red. But because Fire Red has no daytime, the other way to evolve an EV is to send it to Emerald has no daytime, so then what happens if an Eevee in Fire Red gets good happiness? It sits there being a happy little Eevee. <laughs> okay. They just don't exist. Nope. They should have just made it evolve via happiness and just be random. Meh. Then you'd have to reprogram everything. Okay, well here is Wally. He wants to go to the gym. Even though in the game, it's not the first gym, so he's going to be pretty strong. I mean, he's got a Curlier. He could have beat the second gym with his Curlier, even though he hasn't. Yeah. Why didn't he go to Brawly's gym? It'll shut faster. I don't know, because he doesn't have a boat. I don't know, mate. I mean, if you accept Pokemon Origins as canon, then they have different answers. Okay. Remember in Pokemon Origins, it's established that they actually do establish. They, they. Oh yeah. Yeah. He says, "Yeah, you've uh, you've got no badges. I'll just use two Pokemon." Yeah, whatever. We've got trainers in the gym. There's a couple of double battles in the gym we could do. It'll mostly be Marsh, Tomp, and Aaron doing all the work because yeah, they've got the ground type moves. Good point. I should swap one of them into first then. First, we have to get his phone number. Oh yeah. We don't have to go visit. We've already visited Verdant Earth. Oh, hello. You were watching from behind there? How did you see? Do you have x-ray vision? Maybe there's windows in the back of the game corner. Okay, great. See? Uh, Maybe we should show off the game corner in the... Oh, we don't have the coin case. Who needs it? Mm. It's not like you can get one. Aaron or Marsh Tomp? Marsh Tomp actually surprisingly needs more work. Yeah. Whatever, walk between those two trains. Oh, then everyone can go in second. Good point, I wouldn't put Wingo up there. <laughs> that would be screwed. Hello, you two. Why is a fighting type trainer in the electric gym? Who knows? Why is a meta tide in the electric gym? She got lost, okay? But. <laughs> I thought you had to like get approval, you can't just show up. No. Metal claw isn't a good idea. Oh, well neither is detect, but they did it anyway. Oh. Wonderful. See, I'm really annoyed that we missed out on learning mud shot. Yeah. Headbutt works. Yeah, if it can attack. Why would you use quick attack? You're an idiot. What other choice does he have? He used spark, it worked just fine. True. What else is he got? Voltorb, okay. It's mostly just going to be Voltors, Magnemites, and Electronics. Yep. And then for some reason, a meta type. <laughs> she got lost. Maybe she'd, it'd be fine if it learned Thunder Punch, but no. Alright, buddy, you charge. 
don't even know if it's going to get another turn. Oh, it might get another turn. That did crap on me. I know, I guess it didn't have any fighting type moves. Great, another meta type. You really know your electric types. I told you, she's just lost. No, she's not allowed in. She doesn't have electric type, she's not allowed in here. Well, the security ain't very good here. They have security? <laughs> sure, that guy that stands at the door, he's the bouncer. Sure, why not? At least it wasn't detected. Oh, for God's sake, it's not over. Finally. Why would you want to make your attack rise if you're always using the special? I know. Whatever. Are you gonna throw a cherry berry at that one? I guess I should. Okay, it's spicy. Good to know. That means we can make red poke blocks. I don't like spicy food. We never did look at who can learn this stuff. Um. Oh, who should learn it? I don't know. We've got three choices right here. None of them have a rock move, so it's entirely up to you. Uh, you. That's a smart idea. You can use it against the flying types he'll be weak against. Yeah, see, I'm smart sometimes. Yep. Yeah. We've also got wing attack. Maybe Bingo can learn that. Not wing attack, steel wing. <laughs> Not that it matters. The only moves, the only type steel wing is good against is rock, which water is also good against. So steel wing is a bit redundant. Oh well. It's something. No that, one else is gonna. It's not. It. Thank God, in the later games, they at least made steel good against fairy. Oh, ah. Yeah. What's a dark move? Oh, give it to Electric. Yeah. That's better because Electric needs some more variety. Yeah. Okay, that's a bit better. I'll step on this. And then we can go. Hello. And then we'll battle those guys. Yep. That's not an electric type! <laughs> and people criticize Sinnoh for not using the right types. I mean, it's. Plusle and Minen have already been shown in the game. And Plusle and Minen the... won't show up at all in this gym. You'll only see Electric, Magnemite, and Voltorb families. No Plusle and But Minen. two out of three of those aren't even native to this region. And the worst part is, in Ruby and Sapphire, none of his team. none of what's in his team members are native Toan. I find it so stupid when gyms don't use Pokemon that are native to the region. That's why when I wrote a fanfic to, that took place in Johto, I, we changed the gym teams so that Oh, they had... oh yeah, Johto is so bad. The first gym doesn't have any Johto Pokemon, the second gym doesn't, the fourth gym doesn't, the fighting gym doesn't, and yeah, at least half the gyms don't. I even changed the ghost one so that it was only a one-on-one -on -one battle. With, with a mischievous, yeah. Yeah. Because it, it, yeah. They couldn't at least, like, he's got a ghastly two haunter and a ginga. They couldn't have at least swapped out one of the haunters for a mischievous? I don't know. It's the only Johto ghost. I mean, does Bugsy really need a Metapod and a Kakuna? He could have, like, a Spinarak or an Oreodos or something. Lediba. Lediba or Ledian. Heracross. Yeah. Give it Heracross and Scyther, that'd be a better battle. And then the fighting guy, he's got a Polyrath and a Primeape. You couldn't have given him Hippontop or Tyrogue? Well, Tyrogue is a baby, but Hippontop, yeah. Exactly. Show off the new evolution. 
It's not like you're spoiling the late game Pokemon because Tyrogue could have already be gotten from the egg, possibly. Oh yeah, otherwise you have to get it from um, that guy in a cave, which is so annoying. Ah oh, yeah. I know that egg has a really high chance of shiny, but I've still never it's... gotten a shiny from well, it. Well, it's one in eight. That's really good. Why do you have an Ilyamise? That's not an electric type. These people need help. <laughs> Might need to heal Swamp. Yeah, I after will. This. Keep almost calling it Swamp Hurt. <laughs> I'll get there, fine. Oh, Willy. What if we just never evolve him? <laughs> I've totally tried that. I once had a playthrough of a no evolving allowed team, so um, to make it easier, I um, tried to I tried to use mostly Pokemon that evolve with like I don't know trading or stone or something, so like you can avoid it. Oh yeah, all this did, did, all this a challenge run where you can't where you can't learn new moves. So basically, if a Pokemon has four moves, you can never say yes to it. <laughs> You have to get take whatever the first four moves it learns is. Oh god. Couldn't be that bad. You'd be rotating your team a lot because you'd just be like, once you get to better areas, you'd take the higher level Pokemon that probably yeah. start with high, better moves. No, it's a bug type. Okay, 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 okay. Everybody just use headbutt. Now throw a potion on Swamp Herb. But what I'd love to try one day is... Oh right, there's a Volbeat. Is that this guy did this thing where every time you beat a trainer, you get their team. Yeah, you said that. I don't know how it's even possible to program that in a ROM hack, but it sounds fun. I really want to do a um, randomizer for Coliseum. Because Colosseum has so many limited options, it's almost like forcing the Nuzlocke rules because you've only got an limited amount because you can only catch a shadow Pokemon anyway. Oh, yeah. So you don't have to enforce your own rules of what should I use or not use. I should have just gone to the Pokemon Center. Oh, wait, Soda Pop. That's better. That would be fine. Give one to Aaron. Okay. Well, just, just the potion, just the potion. Yeah, yeah. Wait, does one of them have the soft sand, or did we never get the soft sand? We never got the soft sand. Probably not. We're idiots. Yeah. Alright, should we do this? Yeah, we'll do this and then we'll end it. Okay. Yes, I got past all the doors. If it wasn't as annoying as their stupid Lieutenant Surge. It wasn't so annoying, it's just petty. Yeah, exactly. Which makes it annoying. But yeah, like I said, in um, Ruby and Sapphire, his team is just Voltorb, Magnemite, and um, Magnetron. Oh. At least here, he has a mana trick. Yeah. But yeah, which is why it gets dumb in the anime, because he doesn't have any Hoenn Pokemon. Because mm. Emerald didn't exist yet. Oh, uh, yeah. So it started off based on... Like, yeah, it's only until the last gym that they were able to swap it, because they used one instead of Wallace. Yeah. Although, I think this is the only gym that only has non Hoenn, so. Oh, okay. Yeah, they fix most of the gyms. Unfortunately, yeah, which bit is annoying, because then in the remake, they stuck with the Ruby and Sapphire team. What? Because it's oh my god! Speaking of the Sinnoh remakes, I really hope they use the platinum layout for the Ghost Gym. I don't remember there being different layouts. In the platinum one, you have to like use a flashlight and find pictures on the floor to match the door. Oh, cool! In Diamond and Pearl, you have to do maths. <laughs> Sounds fun. I like maths. She walks through a door and there's a trader who says, "Right." No, it's like, you get up to a spot and it says, right, what is the answer to this question? And there'll be multiple choice, and you walk through the door that is correct. Oh, you mean like the Eiffel Tower? Yeah, it's like that. 
<laughs> oh, but it's a bit different because in the Eiffel Tower one, you still have to battle even if you get the correct answer. Oh. Whereas I think in the Diamond and Pearl one, you only battle if you get the wrong answer. Oh. It's like in Cinnabar, some people didn't even notice the machines and they thought they just had to battle the I've trainers. I've seen a few Let's Plays like that, yeah. Ooh, nice critical. I know about the machines, but I choose to battle anyway. Well, yeah, I always battle everyone every way, anyway, too. Besides, like we said in a previous video, it's wrong. The question... Ooh, um, oh, get rid of tackle, yeah, we don't need tackle and head, but... Mm. The question says, true or false, Caterpie evolves into Butterfree. No, did this. Caterpie evolves into Metapod. Whatever, just kill the mana trick. Yeah, yeah. There it is. Yep. Unless he kills us first. Yep. yep. It's okay, we've got plenty of team members. Okay. That's good. He, yeah, that's fine. He'll still resist the electricity. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. Could've seen you. Yeah, I could've. That was a critical? Throw seeds at him. I said I will! Damn, now you die eventually. Mm. Speaking of Leech Seed, I've been playing a really cool ROM hack recently. I say speaking of Leech Seed because I've been using it in the ROM hack a lot because I chose Bulbasaur. It's, it's based on Fire Red, but it's got other Pokemon. Like, I caught a Froakie and a Chespin no. and whatever else. Should use Mach Punch. I think Brilliant's more a physical attacker. Good point. Oh, right. Here's the obligatory Citrus Berry. Yeah. It'll get there eventually. Fine. Oh, Mach Punch. Oh, it's about to say. Yeah. Whatever, we'll get there. We've got Leech Seed. Oh, for goodness <gasps> sake. Use all the potions. Just use them all. Yeah, but did you know in Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee, if the, Ooh, opponent, if the opponent uses an item, like a potion, the text will say, you used a potion. Wait, really? Yeah! I never noticed that. <laughs> yeah. How many super potions do you have? Surely he won't have more than the two he's used. We have healed ourselves fully because <laughs> of this. Just die. Okay, please. next turn better be the last one. It has to. Unless he has a potion. No. No. That was pretty big damage, but it doesn't matter. It was a critical. Yeah. That's that done. Alright, well, we beat Watson, we battled some trainers and Wally. Next time, I think, before we head up, I think we'll head south, see the trick house, see the cycling road, all that good stuff, and the battle tent. Yep, and now we are able to use Rock Smash out of battle with this badge. And we get Shockwave, which will be good for um, Electric. Yeah, but doesn't it have bad accuracy? Or am I thinking of a different electric move? Shockwave literally never misses. Oh, I'm thinking of a different one. Anyway, like I said, we'll see you next time for more Pokemon Emerald. See, see you, you next, next time, time guys. guys.